Tuckfield Street, it's a really lovely old street. It's full of historic houses um, and it's really quiet as well. And it's uh, really close to everything. Like we're right across the road from the Fremantle Arts Centre. Um, the Leisure Centre is just across the road. <laughs> you know, it's so close. You can just walk everywhere or cycle. Uh, I love it being an old home and I love the modern heating and uh, reverse cycle and air conditioning. It's great. Um, it's also uh, alarmed, and so that makes it really secure as well. Three double-sized bedrooms with a very high ceiling and lots of uh, storage space. It's got this fantastic uh, big uh, bathroom as well, and we've got this amazing old clawfoot bath, and that would have to be, I think, our favourite. The living room has an open gas fire, one of those old-fashioned ones, which really suits the house. We also have a really huge kitchen because Ali is a chef. Oh, I love, I love the kitchen. I can, I can cook in the kitchen. Not only one kitchen, two kitchens, a door kitchen. It is a commercial kitchen. I have a, a wok burner, a Japanese weather, and a grill, and it's all commercial. And I can cook all year round. The laundry is separate from the house and it has these uh, great big stainless steel benches and there's lots of storage space and we have a granny flat uh, or teenagers retreat and it even has its own ensuite. I'm an artist and my studio and office are here. It's separate from the house, it uh, has its own entrance so you don't have to come through the house. It's a really big space. Look, it's a great family home and it's really pet friendly. There's lots of space for our gorgeous dog and our two cats. We love it living here. It just got too big for us, just for two of us. And uh, we're just gonna move on down south. And we wish the next couple they would have as much fun as we have.